So I just want to take this moment to briefly talk about magnetic oil plugs and why you would benefit from using one. And first of all, I want to make a short disclaimer. I'm not claiming that all engines function as I will descri describe in the presentation. The sch schematics are mere illustrations of general functionalities that are common. Control valves are, for example, not connected to temperature or revolution gauge, but I use them as an illustration of functionality. In an engine system, we, uh, to the left, have a representation of the engine. Uh, the blue wheel here is the representation of an oil pump and the yellow square on the right side is an oil, oil filter with an oil filter element inside it and to the far right is a spring valve that's inside the oil filter and that is going to play a large role later in the presentation. So normally the oil pump picks up dirty oil from the bit bottom of the engine and feeds it into the oil filter where it's cleaned and then it's returned back to lubricate the, oil, uh, the engine. There is also a control valve that is managed by uh, engine temperature and engine revelations. So in an ideal situation this is how the oil flow would work. What will, would happen when you have a cold engine, as represented by the figure down to the far left, is that the, since the oil has a higher viscosity, it wouldn't be able to feed it through the oil filter. It wouldn't go through the filter element because it's too thick. And then the valve would pass the oil past the oil filter and feed it directly into the engine. This is because the engine, even if it's cold, it still needs lub lubrication. You will have a similar case with a high revving engine. In that case, the oil is thin enough to pass through the oil filter, but the need for lubrication is so high uh, that it won't have time to filter all the oil required to lubricate the engine. Hence, part of the oil is going directly from the oil pump directly back into the engine. Then also you have the condition of a clogged oil filter. You might have good oil temperature and low revelations, but since the filter element is clogged with dirt, it won't be able to pass the oil through the element and hence the spring inside the oil filter will compress and pass all the oil just past the oil filter. In the worst case scenario, you might have a cold engine and it's in high revolutions and clogged fil filter element. Previously, you might have some cleaning of the oil by the filter element, but now absolutely no none of the oil is cleaned. So what you can do is add a magnetic oil plug to the oil sump of the engine, and that would take part of some of the shavings within the oil that would send somewhat cleaner oil to the oil pump, and that would in turn go into the valve and into the filter and thus feed the engine. In ideal conditions you would have an engine temperature that is good, hence you have a viscosity of the oil that is suitable for the oil filter. You would have low revolutions and a clean oil filter. Then it would protect the engine as much as possible. By adding a mag magnetic oil plug into the oil sump you would send oil that is somewhat cleaner of metal shavings through the to the oil pump and through the valve and thus don't need to make the oil filter work as much. So to sum it up, a magnetic oil plug catch metal shavings that are generated by wear and tear inside the engine, it reduces wear on the oil pump and it reduces wear on the engine when it's cold, high revving or the oil filter is clogged. It's also naturally very suitable to put them into a gearbox and a differential where you have no cleaning of the oil at all. And this naturally don't replace the exchange of oil and oil filter on regular conditions. And finally, I just want to say that the Magnet Pro magnetic oil plugs are available in 19 different variants from M10 to M26, including half inch and three quarters inch threads.